Here comes the technical Terminator. A physical reckoning. And a consummate technician. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, weighing in at 193 pounds, Drew Gulak. A proud native of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, a walking torture device. Yeah, Drew Gulak has often said that wrestling in Philadelphia made him tougher. Drew Gulak has a distinctive reputation as a submission specialist. An incredibly high in-ring IQ and... Perhaps the richest man in all of WWE, Cameron Grimes. And guess what, Michael? His fortune is going to... And his opponent, from Burlington, North Carolina, weighing in at 220 pounds, Cameron Grimes! A stock market savant, anything he invests in turns to gold. I wonder if he'll invest in my health food line. Even Grimes' luck has its limits. Moments away from Grimes sending his opponent to the moon. With his unique blend of brutal offense and an in-ring ingenuity, Cameron Grimes has earned himself the nickname of the Technical Savage. I'd say it's pretty fitting. Well, that moniker really says it all. Grimes dishes out some truly devastating blows in the ring, but he's not all brute force. He also knows when it's time that... Can he score the pin? Oh, uh, maybe. Not even a one count there. Still a ways to go in this match based on that. Ouch. And and oh, my God, what a forearm. Right to the jaw. Quick thinking pays off. Counter after counter. Ooh, Harper clothesline. Drew Gulak's deep arsenal can make him a pretty intimidating opponent. So what's the number one thing to keep in mind when facing him? You can't let Gulak take you down to the mat where he can get full control of you. Keep Gulak outside his comfort zone by pressing the attack at all times. This is just brute power. Sherman! Just Here's a cover. And easily kicks out of the count. He's nowhere near ready to stop fighting yet. Line. Gulak just rubbing it in right now. Quick return to the ring. Discus Lariat. That was nasty. Right across the face. That gets reversed on Grimes. With a Southern Light Suplex. A no. He thinks he has it. He powers out at the last moment. That one came down to a razor-thin margin. Caught with a lariat. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Nice counter from Grimes. And a Oof. stomp to the gut, too. Scouted. Ah, and that was taking the attack to the competition with that one. Gulak looking for the Gulak. And he's just in reach of the ropes and gets it to force the break. The ropes become a competitor's best friend in desperate moments like that one. And they just busted out an impactful maneuver. Grimes dodges that one. And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. the tables. A uh, roll up here. No, he pops the shoulder before three. 
Something's about to go either very wrong or very right. From the top right, you'll want to talk about putting it all on the line. Always an extra risk when you dive ringside. Look at the control. What a suplex. There are plenty of ways battling in this area could end in serious harm. And a carefully measured knee drop. Avoiding contact. Uh-oh. Enzularia. Uh-oh. Dropping the elbow right on the knee. He gets back into the ring. Referees count at seven. They need to get back into the ring. He's been this superstar building incredible momentum. Oh, I mean, this is, I don't know how the superstar is doing it. Down and out, moments ago, back in it now. Kick to the knee. Nicely done, locked up and in a deadlift into the German suplex, wow. Course. That's just the technical savage doing what he does best. Doesn't have to be pretty, just effective. Willie had less than a second to stay alive there. Cameron Grimes has his opponent. There's a small package driver. That could finish Drew off. And this one really came down to the wire, but you're looking at the winner who pulled it out. I guess Gulak needs to double-check the numbers in his PowerPoint presentation to figure out exactly what went wrong tonight.